We're being asked to find the inverse of this function. Let's go ahead and do it. So the first step is to replace f of x with y. So y is equal to 2 to the x minus 6 plus 8. The second step is to switch x and y. So x is equal to 2 to the y minus 6 plus 8. The third step is to solve for y. So I'm going to go ahead and write down what we have again. So x is equal to 2 to the y minus 6 plus 8. And to solve this for y, we want to start by isolating the exponential term. So we'll start by subtracting 8. So minus 8, minus 8. So we have 2 to the y minus 6, and that's equal to x minus 8. Now if you're really good at going from exponential form to logarithmic form, you can do that in the next step. If you wanted to show some more work, you could take the log base 2 of both sides. And when you do that, you can use the formula log base b of b to the x, that's equal to x. So here, log base 2 of 2 to the x, this, this whole thing here is your x, is equal to y minus 6. And over here we have log base 2 of x minus 8. To finish, we just add 6 to both sides. So y is equal to 6 plus log base 2 of x minus 8. And the last step is a step that I like to do. I like to actually write down the inverse function using the correct notation. So f inverse of x, that's equal to 6 plus the log base 2 of x minus 8. And that is the final answer. I hope this helps.